Guys, the new Halloween update dropped on Friday, and they added so much new stuff that there's over 20 things you may have missed. So let's go over them together in this video. Be sure to like, subscribe, and comment how many of these you knew. Let's start off with a crazy one. Look at Matt the Bat. It looks different than it used to. The eyes are now red, and they used to be yellow before the Halloween update. It looks kind of creepy, and it kind of confirms that Matt is actually a vampire. Wow, such a big change. That's crazy. Next up we have the new ring cosmetic. This new silver skull ring costs 3500 shiny rocks and it actually has a secret feature that not many people know about. It makes your voice sound deeper and there's tiny particles coming out of it. Speaking of cosmetics and particles, the new Devil Pitchfork cosmetic that costs 4500 shiny rocks also has particles coming out of it when you hit it on the ground. There's a new entity in Gorilla Tag, a purple ghost that flies around until it catches you, and when it does, your screen goes black and white and your voice sounds very deep to others. <laughs> You can't really see the ghost until it's too late. However, you can see it through the crystal ball. And speaking of the crystal ball, that's another thing. You can see a bunch of secret decorations through it. I had no idea when I first updated the game. And I really like this feature. And speaking of crystals, the crystals in the cave map and secret tunnel look different. They have different colors and texture. It looks very Halloween-y. I'm pretty sure this was pink. And these crystals too, I'm pretty sure that's not the color. Speaking of looking, the creepy eyes that you can find throughout the map look at you when you are not looking. Dude, that's so creepy. Are you seeing this? The computer's looking at me. And look at this, Lucy's looking at me. And speaking of- Okay, okay, I'll stop. The old gold mask has been temporarily replaced by this golden skeleton scroll for 5,000 shiny rocks. You can get it by going to the city map, jumping through the window, and then going upstairs where you can find it sitting on a shelf where the old gold helmet used to be. There's a bunch of these stickers around in every map and they're just floating. You can actually put your hand under them just like this. I don't know why they didn't just move them back a couple pixels. If the spider cosmetic wasn't nasty already, it turns out it's actually just a jelly spider and you can eat it. <laughs> Ew. You can hear ghosts when you jump around on the crystals in the caves. Just take a listen. How creepy is that? There's these new brooms in almost every map that you can jump on and ride. Make sure you grab and hold the broom, otherwise you will fall straight through it. You can see a mysterious sphere in the background while riding the broom in the beach map. I really wanted to know what it was, so I decided to use my drone and fly over. And turns out, it's just a crystal ball from the mountains map. I guess that still counts, right? The hitbox of this box in canyons is completely messed up. You can literally go outside of the box and levitate. How did he even manage to do this, dude? But there's an invisible wall right here. This is probably the best hiding spot if you're playing hide and seek in this update. But don't tell anyone I told you. Here's another thing people didn't realize. This mask is actually from the Phantom of the Opera, which is a popular musical. Next up we have the Frankenstein hat. It costs 2500 shiny rocks, and it actually has a secret feature that not many people know about. So if you wear the hat, all you have to do is just wait, and out of nowhere you will see sparks flying out of the hat. Damn, it matches your color really well. Oh my god! Next up we have Lucy the Ghost. She's finally back from last year. There are two versions of this ghost. The blue one called Lucy, which spawns randomly every couple minutes, and the red one, which you have to summon with your friends by tapping around her grave. The red one is actually much faster than the blue one. If you go inside the big pile of leaves, you can see star-shaped holes that allow you to see outside, so you can easily hide from the lava monkeys. Another thing you may have missed is that the paintings in the basement changed and are now Halloween themed. I really like these paintings. There's a ton of references with the skeletons. This one, for example, references Titanic. This one references the ring. These ones reference the three wise monkeys. 
In other words, see no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil. Then we also have this new blue ghost which isn't hostile at all and drops flowers in almost every map. You can throw the flowers into the cauldron in a specific order to make a low gravity potion. I actually have a video on my channel showing every potion recipe. You should totally check it out by clicking on your screen right now. Oh, and you can also see witches flying in the sky after brewing a potion. Let me know in the comments below how many of these you knew. Okay, bye.